you'll, you'll come here, you'll come here. Thanks, Bernardo, for joining us. There you go, there's a mic for you. First of all, from me, congratulations on yet another win here at Old Trafford. It's becoming quite a common theme now in the past few years. But the start of it, though, perhaps not at, at City's best, really. What's, what do you the make first, of the, the first yeah. minutes of the game? Yeah, the first minutes of yeah, the game. Yeah, a bit tricky, the first minutes of the game where we lost a few balls that, that we can't and gave them the, 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 the opportunity to counter and to create a few chances. Um, and that's what they wait, they're waiting for in these kinds of, in these kind of games. So to correct that and to do better in the last 30 minutes of the first half and then uh, most of the second half, I think the performance was brilliant. The way we controlled the tempo, the way we controlled the transitions when we, when we lost the ball, our defenders were really close to their attacking players and we didn't let them break through. And uh, yeah, I think it was a, a very, very good performance apart from, as you said, the first few minutes of the, of the game. But how enjoyable is it to play in games like that? Obviously, once you get the lead, your energy, the relentlessness where you keep going every week, and Tom were talking about it, watching it, even to the last minute, everyone's still moving, everyone is still looking for the ball, everyone is closing down. But it must be enjoyable in those sort of games. Oh, it is, definitely. That's, that's what we train for. And um, if you want to play for Man City, you, need to, 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 you have to want to play and to give an option to the player that has the ball. That's what we do every day, that's what we train, that, that, that's the way that Pep built, built this team. And even if things don't go well, you have to, to try and, 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 and do, do your best to, to keep, keep with the plan. And um, today I think everyone was really good on the ball and without the ball, which I think we lacked a bit against Arsenal. Our pressing was not very effective and we weren't aggressive enough. And today I think we were br brilliant in that. So very happy with the performance. Once you got the penalty, once Erling Haaland puts that penalty away, it looks like you just you dominated yeah, and the then goal, started to relax and play a lot more. Yeah, the goal makes it easier because it gives us what we want, puts us in the lead and then they have to come a bit at us and we don't need to attract them that much to find the space in behind their midfielders. So, yeah, and to score the second goal right, right in the beginning of the second half was also very important for us. But as I said, the way the team played after the first five, ten minutes was, was brilliant and one of the best performances that I can remember away in a big stadium in the last few years. And you're working on training that, because me and Tom were watching it and thinking, I think at one point you were centre-half, John Stones was up on the right wing. You know, it's almost like it doesn't matter who's in what position, as long as you fill those spaces, the manager doesn't seem to mind who's in, in which position. Well, yeah, we try to respect our positions because we know yeah. it's important and each player feels a bit more comfortable in, in, your, in their position. But, if, for example, if I feel that John is out of position and I need to go and support the team in, in his position, I do it, and other players as well. So the important is that the player that's got the ball um, needs, needs to have options, needs to, to have lines of passes, and that's what we, we do every time that, that we try to play and to train. Well, I think I do have to let you go. You have other media opportunities. Just a final one. No, no questions about that decision for the penalty? I haven't watched the, the replay. Okay. Uh, normally when they go to VAR, it's because there's something, but uh, you tell me what do you think. Right, you just have told me <laughs> what they think. We're going to have to let you go. We're going to have to let you go, Bernardo. Thank you so much for joining us.